Hey guys, I'm gonna talk about remote pay. Remote pay is a great application if you want to send an invoice or a payment to a customer that's far away. The difference between smart online order is the, or the customers order them ordering themselves. Remote pay, you're sending them the invoice. So it basically works the opposite. It's a great tool, great feature that you can download right now to your Clover device. I'm gonna show you how that remote pay works. Let's say a customer calls you and says, I want this, this, that, that from your restaurant or from your business. And now you want to send them an invoice so they can pay for this, that, that, that and that or whatever they are asking to buy. So the way it works is you can either start from the register app or from remote pay app. They both work the same. So in this video, I'm gonna start from the register app because once you download remote pay, it will add a feature for you in the register app so you can collect remote payments. Let's say Mike just called or emailed and said, hey, I want this from your business. He took down his order or his whatever uh, he's ordering and then I ring it up. I'm gonna ring up his order. I'm gonna press pay. When you press pay, you'll see a new button here called remote pay. You see how I found remote pay? It's right here, remote pay. When I press remote pay, you'll see a new pop-up. It says six, whatever the total you just rang up, it will show up here right away. Now you have to send the invoice to Mike, Bob, Jim, Susan, Stephanie, whoever ordered. I'm gonna go ahead and send them an invoice. So first thing you do is you fill out their name, you put their email address, and then you put their phone number. I'm gonna go ahead and put a phone number here. Now, the nice thing about remote pay is you can send them an email or a text message. In other words, they can pay from their computer, from their laptop, they can pay from their phone. So you can send a message either way. I'm gonna go ahead and send it to their phone. When I send the phone to their phone, it will automatically send a message. See how my phone just flashed? saying that I got a new text message from remote pay from the business saying, hey, uh, there is a new transaction or a new invoice for you to pay. Once I pay this transaction, the remote pay app will, instead of saying pending, it'll be completed. So all your remote pay transactions will be listed here. The ones that have not been paid yet, it will say pending. The ones that have been paid will say completed. So that's how you do the remote pay.